So did you sleep well? No. Morning number. What is it? Four. Friday. Porridge. This breakfast. We need to restock on uh, firewood if we should stay uh, any longer out in the woods. It's quite sparse left now. We've got one night left, so maybe we should uh, buy some firewood at the local shop or something like that. It's minus uh, three and a half degree outside, so not very cold, but it's uh, still uh, crispy. By uh, Heating up the cabin, we have also woken up the locals. They feel the heat, and uh, I don't know, maybe they think it's uh, summer. Anyway, they are awake. Jag vet inte vad du har lagt sig. another moose again they are really hard to spot we have seen uh, six was it five or six the other day oh, five. And now there is one standing up there in right in the middle of the screen where is it where are my fingers yeah. <laughs> there is one and then there there is uh, another one uh, down there is they are very hard to see they may be 30-50 meters away. There were actually three of them. Um, but they started to run away a little bit when we uh, came. So now they are a little bit more far away. Time is uh, well, 15, 30 I think. We've been on this road for a couple of kilometers, but we feel now that we need to find a hut. Uh, shortest way to the hut is uh, turning back. And we don't know what is in front of us. Those are our tracks. Uh, it could be much more snow, uh, difficulties getting through, and we don't want to get stuck uh, out in the dark and things like that. So we uh, reversed a kilometer and are turning around now there's a small road in there 
uh, but it's also quite deep snow so for the moment we are stuck here we're just gonna dig out a little bit put in the max tracks uh, to get the wheel going again this is maybe i don't know 60 centimeters oh, jesus that was deep uh, 60 centimeters deep yeah it goes all the way to my what do you call it in english brain my valley girls so now it's digging to get the get the car around Ja, jag vågar inte ifall det andra som det... Jag hade fått ta bort stänklapparna först och det var jobbigt. Så nu har vi gått att ta runt lite. Och sen har vi... ...hade för den kabinen. Det var väldigt djupt här. Ser du när jag faller igenom här? Se här. Oj. Look at uh, this here. <laughs> we we're on a search for one of the cabins over here. Uh, there are actually one up in the woods on this uh, old style traditional farm. Uh, we checked all the cabins and uh, the one that is open for hikers mainly is the one up here. Uh, dirt floor benches for uh, I don't know 12 people. Maybe. And a fireplace in the middle. And we got the car over there. Uh, can't actually see now, but it, it, it's right out where it uh, opens up a little bit. Uh, we will check the next one if it's uh, closer to the road. It's just a couple of kilometers away. We check that one out, and otherwise, we return to here. Look at that wooden piece there, Elliot. It's like a gigantic barbecue uh, stick. Uh, the cabin uh, was not, uh, what shall I say, clean enough, according to my wife. So she said, uh, let's go for the tent instead. So here we are, uh, out in uh, yeah, somewhere. <laughs> With the tent just put up in the snow, uh, sleeping mattresses finished, mm -hmm. sleeping uh, bags. Why did it turn so dark? Sleeping bags coming up, dinner coming up, uh, the car is a little bit deep in the snow. Well, actually, I dug it out now so you can't see it. But uh, that's the reason why uh, we have such a great hate to stand and cook here now. Because the car is half meter down in the snow. For the blows are you interested? There you can see it a little bit. There's a shelter over there, but uh, in the end of the trailer. But the wind is uh, going straight into it, so it's not really any need. And it's a really beautiful evening. Sunset. Got a really crispy morning here. It's uh, minus 13 Celsius. Uh, we're just getting out of the tent. Everything is frozen, water, food, everything. So we will see about the breakfast, if we, we ate big, uh, <laughs> bacon and eggs or whatever we will do. Uh, at least when we have packed up. We have to dig out the car, turn around, go down the trail and head south towards home.
Ja, de var goda. Så det är ju sleep well? No. No? Was it too warm? <laughs> so this is uh, last morning. Uh, it was, uh, as I said, a little bit crispy this morning. After 700 meters, we are um, heading down to Charlottenberg. Check out some uh, winter gear at XXL so we can go out on Tuesday. No! <laughs> Uh, we, uh, Charlottenberg is next, uh, but today we are heading home. This was a quite uh, freezing morning, minus 13. It could be much colder, uh, but it's been a nice drift at least, I think so. So this was the recon for the Fimbul winter tour coming up uh, next year. And uh, please join us on that trip and experience the Scandinavian winter.